Oh yeah! It's been long enough. I'm gonna uh, break out the metal detector this week. So before week's end, you will hear the tale of my first experience. Mark, you're welcome to join the little man and I on this quest. But for now, we're going back to the treasure chest, treasure corner, whatever. And this one comes from Charles, and it's a little different. And frankly, it changes everything. Uh, you see, guys, when most detectorists like me go to bed at night, we dream of unearthing a Viking horde under the sands of a deserted Caribbean island or finding a king's crown in the green hills of Scotland. But the definition of treasure, according to Webster's, is this uh, wealth such as money jewels or precious metals stored up or hoarded or wealth of any kind in any form and I want you to pay attention to that second one right there <laughs> wealth of any kind in any form hmm. you, you see it can come um, uh, uh, like one Thai lady uh, her treasure came in the form of something called ambergris you guys know what ambergris is no is it's, it na rock? It's, it's nature's gold you can see it behind me on my screen well isn't gold nature's gold yeah no, that, like that's just gold. Level marketing. Stone. This is this is this this is extra nature's gold. Okay, What's we're just gonna okay. go. It's like a pie. <laughs> yeah, you just to appreciate. You just got to go to a convention. A big the, potato. Three, yeah, three, three it days. Looks behind. like a big potato. You're right. It looks yeah. like a big potato. So what? Basically, what it is is it's whale excrement. What happens is <laughs> is whales, mainly sperm whales, they produce this shit through a process called um, accretion. So whales eat a bunch of like uh, squid, and they have the the beaks on them, and they can't digest it. Right. So the the whale's stomach the bile ducts, uh, they, they secrete this shit so that these beaks and stuff they can't digest can pass through easily and not fuck with the ma the whales. So it gets it gets like all together like a fucking fur ball and a cat, right? Gross. The whale then vomits this shit. It solidifies, floats on the surface of the ocean, and it's worth like almost its weight in gold. It's like fifteen to 20,000 bucks a pound for this wow. shit. Wow. Who's yeah. buying this? Why? What's it for? Okay. So what it is, is there's this stuff. There's this odorless uh, alcohol called amberin. And once you like remove that from the globule, other bullshit, a uh, high, uh, um, high profile uh, perfume companies use that to make the smell last longer and linger after the perfume evaporates. So uh, you like, you know, once so the perfume people, are, people are spraying whale throw up and shit on themselves. Correct. Nice. Correct. Yes. But I mean, it makes the smell linger. So it makes the smell linger, and it's it's mm -hmm. like it's worth a lot of money. Um, Amberin, Amberin, <laughs> yes, Amber perfume. Grease. People are loaded. Th yep. that, that's an industry that's got money for sure. Yeah. So this this Thai woman, uh, Bubba, if you pull the pick again, um, she found this uh, fifteen pound uh, piece of uh, Ambergrin on on a beach in Thailand, and you can see her husband back there. He's he's grabbing his cock because he's got the biggest yeah. piece of Ambergrin. Exactly. In the village, yeah, yeah, he's, um, he's, got, he's like West Coast Joe, acting like it's his Amber Green, but it's yeah, right. Exactly. right, right. All of a that, sudden, his dick grew. <laughs> that patio is a lot nicer now today. Yeah. 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 He's getting a new yeah. scooter. Um, <laughs> so, 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 uh, so what? Ha so now she's got to wait for them, the the people to like you know. Uh, make sure that this is actual real amber grease and once she does she said she's going to help her village out um she's going to have to kill that guy who's grabbing his crotch because he's going to fucking try to steal it from her obviously um <laughs> that guy's and, uh, definitely trying to get a bigger piece of the pie yeah he's he's, he's, he's staying close grabbing his cock um <laughs> if that's what he's doing for the photo shoot <laughs> yeah, yeah uh yeah, but it's crazy though problems uh, back in 2016, three Omani fishermen found this giant piece of ambergris. It's 176 pounds, and they got three million bucks for it. Um, so Whoa, this that's stuff the thing is, sitting in front of them. That's a yeah, whole piece. That's a whole piece of amber ambergris. Holy shit! How do you? Yeah. How can you tell if it's ambergris versus just water trash? Um, well, it's, it's like it, a rock, though, right? Yeah, it looks like a rock. It, it it looks all different. This one is like really hardened behind me, but that one looks like it's like I guess it just came out of the ocean. Where but it can hardens. we go to find it? Yeah. Uh, it washes up on beaches. beaches yeah, um, you got to find where sperm whales live. Use. Wherever sperm, sperm whales. whales. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But no metal detectors because it's not metal. No, no. That's why it's, this changes everything. You, you're gonna need a loose lady, a sperm detector. There you go. Sperm. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, yeah. I don't know. Sperm <laughs> detector. <laughs> when they can really sniff it out. She can smell the ambergris. Uh, this is like this reminds me of that book, The Pearl. Like, like if you find some ambergris, uh, there's a good chance you're going to get fucking murdered by your neighbor. Right. You don't tell yeah. anyone about that shit. Yeah, right. Gonna, I don't yeah. know what, why she's doing that. She said she's going to help the community. I guess she's really liked in the community. Well, but if you're um, in the news, though, then you're probably right. OK, because then like papers have covered you and stuff. And like there's going to be right. like people are going to it's too hot. It's too right. hot to come at you. Exactly. Kind of. I mean, unless you're like, unless you're like a big time ambergris shark, and you are you used to killing people for this stuff, yeah. and you know you're not you're not you're you're ready for the consequences. I mean, I yeah. don't know how hard it would be to rob this lady of her ambergris and leave, go to the other town, the neighboring town. Like, well, I think Cockburn yeah, has get, it already, but 
Yeah. Oh, good. She handed it over. Okay. No, I think he stole it already. Yeah. Um, oh, the cock guy. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I mean, that'd be, a, that'd be a cool movie where she like finds the Ambergrin, but she has to get to the Ambergrin marketplace. And yeah. Knows. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like uh, Romancing the Stone or whatever. Was it? True Some, Romance? Something like that. No, that's like yeah. a lot of Michael that's a Douglas. Great, it's just oh. a great action movie theme. It's like when you got to deliver something to a location, but somebody there's so many people chasing you. Oh, no, you French gotta, Kiss is what I'm thinking. Of. You got to throw in a, a counterfeiter of Ambergrin in there as well. Obviously, in that movie, to, mm-hmm. you know, like it's, somebody yeah. trying to swap it out with you. They keep right. giving you the shitty amber. But you end up with the good yeah. one. Yeah, and they yeah, think that they back. think at the end they have the, the you know, but you, they, they're back with their counterfeit. Yeah. This yeah. could yeah. be this. We should sell this script. Yeah. I need to, Bubba, I need you to delete this part of the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so pretty cool. So, you know, something, something else to look for on the beaches next time you're walking around.